As we await that key decision from the FDA, the massive operation to deliver potentially life-saving vaccines across the country is ramping up. Alex Perez, more from Pfizer storage facility in Kalamazoo, Michigan. So Alex, how has Pfizer been preparing for this moment? Hey there, Deidre. They say they've been preparing for this moment, really, their entire uh, history of the company here. This is what they do, they say, and particularly for this specific moment, the coronavirus response since March. They've been working on this, they say. They've been doing test runs. They've even been doing test shipments to all 50 states. They say they have a well-oiled plan, and they believe things will run smoothly the moment they get that FDA authorization. This is a pretty big facility, and people will be working here 24 Four, seven the moment that green light comes through Deirdre so now what is the process Alex of getting the vaccine doses from the facility to its destinations all the complications including the temperature included yeah, so they say they have a plan that will be executed uh, in a way that will make everything efficient here, they say. So those 2.9 million doses, that's the first batch that's going to head out once they get the green light. Those doses are already here. They're in about 300 freezers where they have been stored. Uh, as you mentioned, the vaccine has to be kept at a very cold temperature. So what happens when they get the green light? Uh, trays filled with vials of the vaccine are removed from those freezers. They're put into these special boxes that can keep that cold temperature for up to 10 days. There will be a, a, a stream of trucks standing by here, UPS and FedEx trucks. Those trays are then put on to those trucks and those trucks head out for distribution, many of them going to airports. And from the airports, when they land, then there'll be other trucks there waiting to distribute it to those specific hospitals and other locations. Now, of course, uh, everyone here wants to make sure that things run smoothly and there's a big security component to this. U.S. Marshals will be here and at distribution sites, making sure that everything goes exactly as it's supposed to. Uh, this has been months in the making, and really you can feel it in the air here. They're waiting uh, for that green light to get the ball moving here. And De Deirdre, they say they think they can get all 2.9 million doses out of their doors here within about 24 hours after getting that green light. Hi everyone, George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.